Hi everyone, so uh, welcome back to uh, our Tom Cruise kind of movie poster thing that we've been working on. Um, in the last lesson we were looking at adjustment layers, all these adjustment layers which you can generate here. There are loads of them, feel free to play. And how to turn an adjustment layer into a clipping mask. That little arrow there tells me that this adjustment layer is a clipping mask. So it only affects the layer directly beneath it which is called Tom's Eye. Okay. Today we're going to have a look at um, brushes and how we can mess with brushes to create different effects. So if we go to our paintbrush tool, well there's our paintbrush tool, I'm going to draw a line. Well that's not a very good line. Uh, Control Z. Uh, let's not draw directly on the Tom's Eye layer. Let's make a new layer. This is going to be for drawing something. I don't want it to be anything to do with a clipping mask for Tom's eye. So I'm going to try and drag that out of there. It's still a clipping mask, look. How can I... Oh! Release clipping mask. Okay. Brilliant. Now it's just a normal layer again. And what I'm going to try and do is create cuts on Tom's face to make it look like he's been fighting or something. And I'm going to paint some cuts onto his face. How amateurish. What a terrible looking cut. Tom, I'm sorry. It's way too thick. Let's just go to the brush preset here and just put the diameter down a bit. Let's have a look at that. It still looks a bit fake, doesn't it? What a terrible looking cut. Control Z. What can we do? I've selected the brush. Let's go to the brushes um, window. This is the brushes window. Now if you can't find it, for example now, I can't find it, go to Window, Brushes. Shortcut is F5. Let's just try the shortcut. F5, where are you? There we are. Brilliant. So this is my Brushes window. Now let's click on Shape Dynamics. Look at this. This tells us what the brush is currently looking like. And I can mess with that and all these different things here and it will tell me exactly what the result is in this little window down here. So let's just test that. Remember I have made a new layer called Cuts so that's what I'm going to stay on right now. Well, that's looking a bit better. It's looking a bit more like a cut. Okay. Control Z. What else can we do? Scattering. Let's try a bit of scattering. Okay. Well, okay, I'm not really sure what I'm doing. Oh dear, what's that all about? Let's see what happens if we do that. Ooh. Okay, that's interesting. Let's take that off. Not bad, not bad. Let's have a look at some other stuff. Let's go to texture. What is all this about? The texture layer, scale, depth. Well, it doesn't really do, do very much, does it? Let's choose a different texture. Is that going to do anything? Wow, it doesn't do very much, does it? Mode. What is mode? Okay, let's have a look. Okay, not bad, but not great either. I wonder if I'm using the right brush. Let's go to brush. And we'll select a new brush. So there's a new brush. Let's go to Shape Dynamics and Scattering and we'll just mess around with with some of these things. Again, I don't really know what I'm doing but I'm not afraid to have a go. Let's go to Scattering again. Okay, that's, that's not bad. Oops, Scatter, look at that. Let's just try it. Oh, it's very big, isn't it? Control Z. Let's go to the diameter, make it smaller. Wow, this is looking a bit better, a bit more promising. Um, should we should we bother messing with texture? Test it again. Oh, okay, looking better. Now then, let's change the color. 
to a darker black. Try again. Let's make the diameter a little bit bigger. Wow, it looks like he's got some strange disease, doesn't it? That's looking a bit better, isn't it? And I'll tell you what, on this layer called Cuts, can we now use the eraser to erase some of this stuff? Hey, check it out. My eraser is also a brush, so I can also set it up using this brush's preset. This is for the eraser now. If I click on Paintbrush, it's different. If I go to Brush, sorry, Eraser, it's different. Again, I can play with this. Wow, what is all this? This is, this is my Eraser. It's got a shape dynamics, okay. Okay, let's just kind of mess around with, with that. Try and make Tom look a bit harder. Let's go back to the brush. This is the this is what we've got at the moment. In fact, let's let's do that. No, let's not do that. Um, let's make the brush diameter a little bit narrower. We'll do that again, and then let's go back to the er eraser and just kind of get rid of some of it and we'll give it make it look like he's got some problems with his face so that's a very quick introduction to how you can play with brushes and there's lots of options here and remember brushes don't just apply to something like the paintbrush you can also set up your eraser to have a specific style and if you don't want any of the styles turn them off and you get back to your regular eraser tool which will erase everything for you. Okay.